Hey guys, if you haven't, make sure to subscribe to me, turn on push notifications, and like this video. We're back at the garage. I'm going to show you how to program garage door. Plus, I'm also going to show you something really cool. So, I have two garage door openers here. We got this little black one right here. So, it's, they're both genies. The black one works, the little black one. This one has three, and we're going to program this one today. This one we're going to use to open the garage. So, we're going to do that real quick. So if you look up here, see that little stopper thing? I'm gonna push the button. And I push it, it'll stop it. Once it hits it, it'll know to stop it. So let's see what it's up. You can see the chain is going in. And here comes the stopper. And there it is. So first thing to do is we're gonna have to pop this little box open. So you're gonna have to push back on these things to push it down a bit, and push that down a bit, and then you push that down and it's ready to come down. You pull it down and here we go. Here is the little red light right there. You can't see it though. It's right there. I'm gonna push the button. I'm gonna push the button. It's gonna light up. You have to press and hold the button on the garage door opener. I'm gonna press it and hold it. Gonna hold it. Keep holding. Have to hold it for about 30 seconds. Keep holding. Press and hold. I kind of don't exactly know how this works, but I know you have to hold it. Come on. The light is now solid. It's not doing anything. Oh. There we go. So that's how to program it. You just fool around with it. You have to push that program button and hold it for about 30 seconds. Wait till the light is solid, and then I believe you test it. And for some reason, the thing is a little got backwards. It still works. It's open. Now, as also remember when we did the shovel thing, if you didn't see that video, I'm going to show you real quick with the remote that this thing will not. You can't press and hold it to close it. You have to use the other button. Anyway. Now we're going to close the garage. And as it closes up. And there we go. And then once you're done, you're going to close up the little box up here. Make sure that you basically got to slam it in. Like that. That's up. And I'm just going to do a demonstration of that again. Because you have to do it hard. You can't go like this. You have to push it so that way it goes in. So doing that is the best way. So anyway, we're going to go outside and I'm going to show you an example of how this works on the outside. Open. And yeah, it did reverse itself, but now it's red for some reason. It's happened before. And as it goes up, over the head, and now close it. Using a little remote. And that's how you program it. And then if we use the center thing, we we'll open it. So yep, yeah, that's it.
Close it up. Close the video. And that's where we will call it quits. And that's how you, well, yeah, that's how you do it. Oh, sensor over there. If you foot in the way while it's close, it's not gonna do anything. Um, so yeah, that's it. Uh, the garage is now closed, and that's how you program it. So you go, put that little button, just to hold it, pull around with it a bit. And that's basically how you do it. And that's what I'm going to end on. So make sure to see us, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Vote for 200 subscribers special on my website at james 2 day 439weeblycom That would really help. So yeah. That's it for the video. Oh, one other thing real quick. This thing right here. Uh, it's not showing you. My shadow's in the way. There we go. This is the thing, the little thing you see on the outside. And it goes over to the sides over here. You're gonna... And I still have no idea what it does. Whether it's supposed to lock it? I don't know. Well, we're gonna end the video there. Thanks for watching. See you less. Vote for 200 subscribers special. Hey guys, make sure to become a fellow James Tuber today by subscribing to me and check out my similar video.